We just learned how to make fresh homemade pasta with Chef Fabio Viviani, and now yep. he's gonna show us how to transform the pasta dough into ravioli. Yes, because ravioli with one L, not two, it knows I was I was trying to practice my Italiano. So, okay. we'll get the pasta, we stretch it. Okay. And now it gets funny, we gotta stretch it again. It's as long as me. It's good. Okay. So, now put it here, beautiful. So, cut them in half, careful with that. One and two. So ravioli making is nothing else than prepping two sheets of pasta, putting some filling in the middle. In this case, we have a little ricotta, mm -hmm. Italian ricotta and herbs. Just like that. Nice and simple. Nice and simple. So Just we're gonna like space that. them out a couple inches apart from each other. Yeah, a couple inches apart or less than that if you want smaller ravioli or more than that if you want a bigger ravioli. Okay. The sides, in this case, do not matter because the taste will not get improved mm -hmm. by the size of the ravioli. So then, in order to connect and make mm -hmm. sure that they don't break in the water two sheets of pasta, you have to moist one of the layer. So three finger okay. techniques, dip your finger in water okay. and kind of brush the pasta like that. So this is going to bind those two pieces together. Correct, because the water is going to act as a gluten mm -hmm. Like almost like a collagen. And this is what we do here. Cover like that. And with Ooh, your hand. Find that little piece yeah, of ricotta. Yeah, you kind of find a little piece of ricotta like that. See that? Yeah. Now, America is the only country <laughs> where a business like selling cookie cutter exists. <laughs> In Italy, we have cookie cutter. Uh -huh. We call them water glass or yeah. mason jar. Okay, I have one for you. Or keychain or something, whatever. A keychain. A keychain, you can do, you can cut. So here's what we need to do. With the mason jar, you need to go here. Oh my gosh, a perfect little ravioli. Look at that. It looked like and a you didn't even need a cookie cutter. It looked like a little donut made out of love and ricotta cheese. Look at that. I want to do a one of those. little bonbon right here. Bonbon. Yeah. Man. Seal it. Okay. Maybe a little bit harder. Press it, yeah. Okay. Now, this is not suggested to do with wine glass, okay? Because <laughs> wine glass, they can shatter, and you don't want to hurt your hand, and, you know, that's not good. Oh, yum. Three. Yep. These are the lune in Italy. Uh -huh. Luna means moons. So this has the shape of a full moon. And now we just made ravioli. Awesome. Then how long do you cook these for? Well, you just got to put them in the water. Mm -hmm. Every food show keeps telling you the best way to figure it out when fresh pasta is cooked uh -huh. is when it raises to the top yes. and float. Well, I'll tell you this much. When the pasta float is actually overcooked. Oh. So the moment they're out of a bunch, you see the first two, three floats. That's when you start taking them take out? Take them all out, okay. all of them. All right, thank you, you Chef. Know, you know more about pasta than you should. And be sure to check out our other videos where Chef taught me how to make fresh homemade pasta and one of his favorite appetizers, bruschetta. Perfect. <laughs> I'm Brandy, we'll see you next time on Pop Sugar.